Okay, what we're going to go over here is how to mount the H3 Pro 6N onto the top of a particular helmet. Um, most helmets that you can buy will have this hole pattern up on the top for the head to breathe. And they'll, the top center hole inside here, you can put a 3 8 bolt with a lock nut and washer. So we're going to slide that into the hole assembly. So that that will come through like so. Then we'll, because this is a 3 8 mount, we'll just plug, screw this in on the top of that. And I put a lock nut inside of here so that um, it will tighten. And then I also can just add uh, this particular mount on top. Now you can use the Pro 6N. Um, that will allow you to connect the mount like this up on top. And what we used to have this camera right flush to the top of the helmet, um, but we've discovered having a little bit farther up, the camera will just get the edge of the helmet gear, and then it's easier to lay the nadir patch uh, up on top of the helmet side of it. Um, you can also use the Pro 7 to do this as well. The, the Pro 6N will get you a little bit closer because it will be down in here in this area. And if we use the Pro 7, the Pro 7 also has the ability to screw into this mount here up on top. Uh, and again, that's a little bit higher, but it will just grab the edge of the helmet in this particular uh, exercise. But uh, having it right flush, we've discovered that it was too much of the helmet. But if you went higher, you could get the person's shoulder, get the front of the face, uh, and do it that way. So that's how you connect the HC Pro 6N, which is this one here, uh, or the HC Pro 7 uh, to a helmet. Thank you.